Okay, I've already verified that the laser can make the the uh, mark around it. This is basically a three inch uh, square. I'm gonna have it infill with laser. I'm gonna go ahead and put just put the camera on top of it. I don't know if you'll be able to hear me, but I'll put the camera on top of it and uh, have the camera watch a little bit of this. So first I'm going to go ahead and have it do the square thing to make sure that it's pretty much uh, centered. Okay, the laser was on for that, so it pretty much went over the same area. Now I'm going to have it do an infill and my main goal is molecular phase change of the ABS to a liquid state for a very short amount of time. Uh, I'm, I'm going to hope that it improves the image quality of this part. Okay, so uh, with lasers you have a pulse time on and a distance on, so the pulses are set to be uh, 0.1 millimeter apart. Uh, hopefully uh, that's enough. Uh, actually, I might try it a little bit narrower. Hold on. Okay, correct that. I changed it to point. Oh, 05 millimeter, so um, basically a twentieth of a millimeter. I did that because this is my first test. I'm going to run at 15 milliwatt, excuse me, 15 watts. See if that's enough. This is a black part, so we'll see how it goes. The idea is that the the lines and grooves in the plastic should hopefully disappear. Okay, I'm starting. Hopefully the part doesn't move around too much. Let's see what happens. Now what should happen is you should start to see the uh, area around the white beneath uh, should start browning. You should start seeing gassing of uh, plastic material here soon. Um, I don't have a lot of ventilation here, but uh, hopefully I have enough. And what I'm hoping for is that this object um, <clears throat> does a, a material, uh, a molecular phase change from a solid to a liquid back to a solid in a very, very short amount of time from the excitement from the laser light. Uh, effectively uh, doing what um, acetone would, but um, with a much more controlled process. So it's about to hit the plastic. Now it's already hitting the plastic a little bit. So what I'm hoping will happen is that this part will become really smooth. Uh, the pulses are set to 0.05 millimeters. Uh, we'll see what will happen. I can only record for uh, up to 10 minutes or so, so I'm going to do a little bit of this and then I'm going to show it uh, when it's finishing and then uh, go back from there. So. Uh, what I did is first I did a, a, a draw around the area so I knew where to place the part and then um, I made sure that the laser had the uh, three or four inch focus needed and then I made it so the laser has a dot spacing of 0.05 millimeters and currently 
it's scanning, doing a vector draw of a complete dark uh, square, and it's doing the infill vector. And I'm hoping that when it hits the uh, ABS plastic, which it is doing a little bit now, that it will smooth the plastic by temporarily doing a phase change to a liquid and then back to a solid with gravity taking effect for a short amount of time. So, alright, I'm going to stop this now and I'm going to show a picture after it's done.